Next guest this evening is a man who hardly needs any introduction. He's travelled the world over and he's used to people saying that about him, I'm sure. Paddy Maloney, you're very welcome. Good Margaret, thank you very much. Now, Paddy, you're a very experienced uh, Ellen Pipe player. But what is your impression of the, the, the young people playing the Ellen Pipe today, or the state of Ellen Pipe playing today? Very encouraging, uh, let me say that for a start. I mean, uh, years ago, and uh, I won't say how many years ago <laughs> when I started, but I was about eight or nine and went to the Leo, the late Leo Rowson, who taught me. It was only a handful at that time, but now I travel, as you say, a lot. Uh, every time I come back, I hear some recording or some piper playing, and it turns out to be a young person. Superb, fantastic technique, and I've never heard of them before, but they're popping up all the time now. So uh, there's no fears of the art of pipering dying. Um, it's very much alive, thanks be to God. Well, we're dying to hear you play yourself. What would you like to play? You might regret it. Anyway, I um, <laughs> uh, thought I might try with a slow air, Ine Nonit on Gaon, and uh, it's sort of semi-related, you might say, to the blackboard, just sort of touches, and I might go into the blackboard after that. <laughs> 